All right, guys, welcome back. Today, we are loaded up, as you can see. We got the ice chest, all our food. We throw the heavy stuff in the back here. Eventually, we'll have a full kitchen and we won't have to do this here. But until then, we just stack it in the back and then pull it out or operate out of the back. It's nice, even with the rain, we got this over us a little bit. So until we get further along on the build, this is how we operate. But today, we are loaded up and we are going camping. So we're all geared up, hooked up, kids loaded up, most of them, if we didn't miss any, and we are hitting the road. Are we ready to go camping? Yes! All right. Just pulled over here at this at this overlook give the kids a little break check out the view that's what they call the arkansas grand canyon it's it's beautiful love this area up here but we're headed on up we're about to drop down into jasper and then we'll be going um on past jasper a little ways to a campsite but uh yeah that's what we're doing campers pulling good uh so far suburban's pulling it great through the hills this is the first real set of hills i've pulled it through that's part of the reason i wanted to get the brakes done because uh, i knew i was going to be pulling it up here and the brakes are working really good so but we're about to drop down into jasper so that's probably the steepest portion that will go downhill so i'll get to try them out a little, even a little bit more there so we're excited <laughs> Thank you. 
big and small. Oh, there we go. I can't tell how high, how high we up we are, but I'm pretty sure we're, there's probably a bluff right over there. Yeah. This is a pretty drive though. Too bad we weren't up here a little bit earlier, but still the sunset's beautiful. So our third place was also a bust. We couldn't find anything on that road. So we're taking another road that goes to an area where I've been before, but I've never been on this road. So far it's not too bad. And we got some pretty cool views of what's left of the sunset. I'm pretty sure there's a cliff right over there, but I, I really can't tell. I see an airplane. Yeah. Yep, sure enough. So we will see how far we have to go down this road and hopefully we stumble across a campsite in the near future. Yeah, we got an unhappy baby who wants to eat and three other people who will want to eat. Well, actually five other people who want to eat. And we're gonna have a angry mama pretty soon. Oh look, we're going down a hill. This looks interesting. At this point, we're just exploring with a camper. Which hey. brakes just locked up going down that hill. But I'm glad I have them. And glad they work. Yeah. Can't tell on camera, but it's kinda steep ish here. <laughs> this is what we call adventuring. <laughs> Though we would have liked to have had the camp spot an hour and a half ago. This road is continuing to get more and more sketchy. But so far, it's not too bad. This is why we built a camper like we have, because it's capable of this. Your feet can be in the view. Look at that nice fire. Look at those beautiful feet. Uh, you probably can't hardly see me right now, except for a little bit of firelight. But we finally found a camp spot, a primitive camp spot out here in the middle of nowhere, basically, in the Buffalo National Forest National Park. Um, and we're getting the kids in bed. Made a fire, cooked some hot dogs. We, get, we rolled in, we found this camp spot at about 7.45. And now it's, what, 9.00? Sounds about right. So now it's about nine and we got the kids in bed. And we're just gonna enjoy the fire and then get it put out and get some sleep and then figure out what we're gonna do tomorrow. We plan on going hiking. We haven't decided exactly where. And since we ended up way over here, instead of where we planned to camp at, where we were planning to hike at is a little further away. But I'll pull out the maps and see. Uh -huh see what an interesting route to get there might be. We might be taking a bunch more back roads, so. We'll see. All right, it's morning. We are up and loaded up. Ate some homemade chocolate chip banana muffins Sarah made so we could have a quick breakfast and not have to cook because we're gonna try to go somewhere in hike. So we're trying to get on the road and get to the hiking spot pretty quick this morning. I think it's like eight o'clock at this point or something. So we're a little behind what we thought we'd be, but we are loaded up and ready to roll. So it turned out to be a pretty cool little camp spot. Probably better than a campground because we were out here all by ourselves. Haven't seen another person since we basically left the pavement. We saw one person after we left the pavement, <laughs> but it's been empty. This road doesn't get much traffic, I don't think, but this is the road we came in on. And here is our little camp. The 
the, that rad right there. That's a dogwood. There's a ton of dogwoods out here, and they are all... There's another one right over there, that red tree. And they're just beautiful right now. Cool spot. We may be back sometime. But we're about loaded up, and we're going to head down the road. I think we're going to keep going down this road. And I know where it comes out. I've never been down it. So it might get interesting, but we're going to head down that way and use that as the route to get to some of our hiking trails. So it should be interesting. of them 
Yeah, they're really hard to see, but they're down in there. Oh, there it goes. That's what it looks like a female. There's two females. Yeah, there's still a female and a male. There goes the other male and the female. It's just a door going outside. Yeah, I think there's less here than there was. Yeah, every time we come here, there's less paper on the walls because people tear it off and don't take care of things. For red eggs in this box means that your subscription has expired. You can review. For 25 cents. Why do people tear the paper? Because Woman's they girl. don't respect it. I've never heard of that. You should never tear something up that isn't yours. And this is where I this is, this is a historic place. It's old and it's really neat to see how people did things years ago. So you, can all the paper you don't want to tear it up. It's to help keep, the, keep it warm. Insulate it. I'm not warm. Sunday, December, no idea. Somewhere over here, there was something about someone's wife in prison. <gasps> I don't know where it went. <laughs> someone's wife in prison? It said so, it, I couldn't read the first word, and it said wife in prison. That sounds Sent entertaining. Like that. Where'd it go? It was interesting, but I couldn't read it. It's never been in that thing. I don't know what that thing is. Let me give This is probably where kids would have slept back in the day, up in the loft. Yeah. 